Hi, my name is Shizhen. I'm a bridal hair makeup artist. I run my own business called Canvasity. I've been running it for five years now. Um, aside from that, I'm also a finance and admin executive at Coworking Space. And in my free time, I'm also a dancer. We're dancing with a street crew called uh, Kama Edition and also Lynx Edition. Hey, hi, uh, I'm Ryan. I'm 23 and I'm a year three sports management student in NTU. Outside of school, I'm also a barber. I work at Debenet Atelier, but I also cut hair on my own in school just to earn like a bit of side money. Uh, some might say I'm a full-time student and part-time barber, but all of you think otherwise. Lah. I think I'm a full-time barber and part-time student. Yeah. So I went into makeup mainly because of dance, um, because dance actually comes in hand in hand with makeup quite often when we perform. And I was really interested in it since I was in secondary school. So it became like a natural thing for me to pursue it when I started to decide what I want to do as my career. I always had interest in hair. Like you know, like guys don't really wear makeup, you know. So what what else can we do to make ourselves look good? Is is to get a, a, a damn good haircut. Just from a simple haircut, you can go from looking very sloppy to looking very smart. And I think a haircut can transform a man's life. You know, like somebody walks into the shop, then he doesn't know what he wants. Then I just tell him, bro, trust me. And then he walks out feeling a lot better about himself. He feels very confident because he never knew he could look this good. But then uh, now he looks like a like, like million dollars, you know. And that, that brings me a lot of joy. Yeah. Well, during Circuit Breaker, no one could go out to dance, right? So there were a lot of teachers that were teaching via Instagram Live or they even upload videos on YouTube and they just teach and just learn from the videos. So from those sessions, I actually used a earpiece to learn because I didn't want to disturb my family because everyone was in the same house. When I was trying to learn a dance piece with my other earpiece, it kept falling off whenever I was doing a turn or when I'm trying to fool out. Like one side will always fall off, so I always have to hold on to one side while I dance because I can't manage to catch both sides. And even if I try the, the wired earpiece, I have to be in the same position, I can't turn around as well, so it was quite frustrating. So when I first received the CX400 BT True Wireless, I've actually danced with it a couple of times and they have this twist and lock function where you basically insert and then you twist it so that there's a slight suction so it doesn't feel like it's going to fall off anytime soon. This one was in my ear the entire time so yeah, that was great for me. I'm not like an audiophile per se but like I, I do take like my audio devices very seriously lah because I like, I like to listen to music. I like to hear everything that, that is within a, a song. So when I was trying to set up the whole thing, like trying to read the instructions and connecting the Bluetooth, it was really easy. I could connect to my phone, I could connect it to my laptop. So that was quite seamless. So this was really good. I've been using it for all my team calls for my work. I, I, I rarely need to charge it. I think every time I've needed it, I, I've been able to just put it in and use it. I, it's never come to a point where I run out of battery. When I take, take a two hour train back home, you know, like, so, so very, very satisfying. So with most uh, Sennheiser wireless audio products, they have a smart control app on, on, that we can download on our mobile devices. La. So the first thing is that you can adjust the equalizers, which I did play around with because like, I wanted to hear like, the extent of its capabilities. You know? So I, I played around with the bass, the treble, the mid-tones and everything. The initial uh, tap function was actually play and pause on my left side and then the voice assistant on my right side. But as a right-hander myself, like, I'm really used to tapping on my right side more often and I was able to customise the touch control. So I swapped both, so it's a lot more in tune to my lifestyle and yeah, suits me a lot better. I found that the de default settings on the earbuds were, were, were good enough. Like, like, it's very simple, it's very accessible, and I don't think I need to change them at all. Like, like recently, I had a meeting with my, my army mates to discuss our reservist stuff. Then I can do it on the go. So I just like put, put this in, then I on the meeting, and I just walk around, do, do whatever other things I can do, you know. When I actually wear this, I don't feel like it was causing any kind of ear ache. Yeah, it was really comfortable, didn't feel like I was wearing it. Like sometimes I forget that I wear it as well. So for like uh, a, a good audio device, I really put a lot of effort into doing my research, into finding what's right for me. And then once I find it, I, 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 just, I just take it, you know. I think that's something that we should, we should all strive to, strive to do, uh, no matter what we do. Uh, in our life. A quote that I live by is actually shared from a friend 10 years ago when I was talking to her. She said, there's no point running the short race, you got to run the long race. And that really struck a chord in me and it's something that I live by to this day. Whenever I'm pursuing something, I always look for the long-term future. And having this Sennheiser earbuds, it really complements my lifestyle. It doesn't obstruct my life. It flows a lot smoother for me. So yeah, really happy about it. If you think you like something, if you think you're going to do that thing or use that thing for, for a long time, Go spend some time making sure that, that it's right for you. And then once you know it's right for you, commit. Commit all the way and, and, and never stop.